A program that started right here in Chicago to try and curb violence is now being replicated across the country. The idea is to treat violence as a public health epidemic, which, as Kenneth Craig reports, is making a difference in one New York City. We go pay for push-ups. At 38 years old, Jacona Vinson is hitting the streets. Is that easy? Is that easy? To teach young people what he learned the hard way. If I had somebody that could have gave me guidance and direction, I would have never went to prison. You believe that? I know that. Vincent spent 16 years in prison for second degree murder and gang assault. Behind bars, he had a revelation. I said to myself, like, I'm going to use my influence and who I am, my popularity, to bring positive change. For three years, he's been part of a New York State mentoring program called Project Snug. It trains former prisoners to help break the cycle of violence. You let us know how we can help. By reaching out to high-risk youth like 13-year-old Kevin Gonzalez. I'd be hanging around with people that were in gangs and all that, and it was crazy. And it's hard to get out of something you got into. Project Snug is modeled after Cure Violence, a Chicago program that's been replicated across the country. You do it by personal relationship, nothing more, like really, really showing them that you truly care. In Mount Vernon, Project Snug operates in the neighborhood with the highest rate of gun violence. Within that one square mile, there were 16 shooting victims in 2016. So far this year, that number has dropped to four. And have you seen lives transform in front of your eyes? Yes. Yes, I have. I uh, shake it again. Kevin says thanks to his new role model, he's turned his life around and has set his sights on college and a bright future. Kenneth Craig, CBS 2 News.